My name is Colleen Coppinger and I'm the owner of Painting with a Twist in Grapevine. The twist about Painting with a Twist is that you can bring in whatever beverage you want to drink while you're painting. Most people choose to bring a bottle of wine and these two were donated by the two local wineries that are my favorites, Homestead and Sloan and William. We provide everything you need for your wine, including a corkscrew, but I find a lot of people don't know how to use one of these, so I decided to make a short video to show you how easy it is. This particular corkscrew is called a double pull because it has two levers. It also has a little knife for cutting the uh, foil and the actual corkscrew itself. The first step is to remove the foil capsule, which I just recently discovered that's what it was called. Uh, some of them you can just pull it right off, but others require you to use actually use the little knife that's on the corkscrew. Most wine bottles have a little lip here. Uh, you can either cut above the lip or below the lip Personally, I like to cut above. Um, I find it's helpful to hold the corkscrew like a potato peeler, like you're going to be peeling a potato. Um, and then you're just going to rest the blade next to the bottle against the little ledge. And I like to turn the bottle and just kind of hold my hand steady. And it really does just feel a lot like peeling a potato or an apple. And I like to go a little bit past where I started, just to be sure I get it cut all the way off. And then you can just lift that right off. Step two is actually removing the cork. You'll want to open the corkscrew all the way up like this. Um, then you're going to take the little point, come in at a 45 degree angle, slightly off center. Then I like to just start turning the bottle and pressing in. And then once you get it straightened up, you can just turn it just like a regular corkscrew. We're going to push it all the way in until the, the very last rung is right above the cork. You don't want to go too far because you might get some cork in your wine. So step three is actually removing the cork by using the levers on the corkscrew. There's two of these on this one. So you're going to rest the first one right there on the lip of the bottle. I like to grab a hold of it and kind of support it. And then we're just going to pull up on the actual corkscrew. Pull up as far as it'll go. Then you're going to bend that back down and that will allow you to put the second little lever on the lip of the bottle. I still like to hold on to it and go ahead and pull the cork all the way out. So now just take your cork off the corkscrew and enjoy the best part, have a glass of wine. If you'd like to come and paint and drink sometime, you don't need any artistic experience at all. Just go to our calendar at paintingwithatwist.com slash grapevine. Find a painting you like and sign up. We hope to see you soon.